Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is Iron Sheik 84, and we are going to do the Trish Trio Limited Time Tour. Uh, hope you all are having a fantastic Wednesday so far. Uh, I just had, I've just been working all day and just got off, got my stream and uh, stuff set up, and yeah, here we go. Wolfman1941, thank you very much for the follow. Much appreciated. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, congrats on just finishing it. Yeah, like I said, uh, M. Jackson, how's it going? As always, shout out to AK6, Carbot, Godfather, St. Avberry, and Wolfman. And of course, M. Jackson, for some reason, not showing up here. <laughs> but yeah, um... So earlier on my phone, I was having the issue, same issues that everybody else was with the, with the, with whatever reason the uh game crashing so I'm, I'm keeping my fingers crossed and hoping that that doesn't happen here but we'll we'll see just pulled sasha congratulations i'm still hoping that eventually i'm able to pull her from uh that epic shard chest thing that they give out that they give us a couple of times a month unfortunately haven't had much luck with uh getting the fiend or sasha shards out of there Charge. Mickey five SS before working. Yeah, I yeah. Given given the two, I I definitely I, I'd work on Mickey before before Sasha. So um, I do have a I do have a bit of uh, good news to share. Uh, from Sunday um, so uh, y'all remember I mentioned that I was like really close to hitting the last milestone of the wild one solo thing well uh, after the stream was over I decided to attempt to max out the priest event which I could because of Gargano and everything uh, so that plus the coin Evo event and everything meant that I did max the solo event so not only did I did did I get the chase character, I also uh, maxed the the solo event. So yeah, I, I got nothing else to do, and all I got to do now is just chill. Oh, thanks, man. Yeah, your Mickey has a T5 200% yellow move damage. Goddamn. <laughs> Oof. Man, that's a spicy meatball right there. I really need to. I really need to focus more on getting some of those T5 medals, especially. I'm hoping that I'm able to pull one for Scott Hall at some point. No, the Hall of Fame Scott Hall. Yeah, trust me. Yeah, trust me. If I was in that, if I am not disputing what you're doing in any way, shape, or form. If I was in your boots, I'd do the exact same thing. Every single time I'm seeing lag or a slowdown, I'm like worried that this thing's gonna, uh, that that the stream's gonna crap out on me. <laughs> but yeah. Also, I am in my fabulous little office area again. Uh, my little one is taking a nap, and I didn't want to wake him up. Two MP trainers and a finisher does over. Yeah. Yeah, I still don't have a five SS woman yet. Uh, I was gonna, I was gonna put China there, but I might put her on hold, and subsequently put uh, zombie, uh, zombie Roman Reigns on hold and shoot uh, uh, all the always shine Naomi straight to the moon and make her uh, my first five SS woman. Fishcan, thank you very much for the for the host. Good to see you as always, sir. How's that priest pull working out for you so far? It's 
It's good to hear. St. Avery, how's it going? I'm having a really good day. Uh, there was a meeting that I really didn't want to be in and they canceled it, so that made me super happy. <laughs> And then, uh, just been chilling. Uh, now normally I would do this stream leading up to DJ's tonight, but, uh, I got groceries to get and a couple of other things, so I figured I'd just do it now and be able to do it in peace rather than having to rush through it later. But yeah, uh, how'd y'all's uh, Father's Day go, by the way? So, um, after I got done with the stream in the morning, my brothers and I, we tried to figure out where we wanted to go, and my dad was being a little indecisive about where he wanted us to take him. So, uh, you know, we kind of threw out a couple choices, you know, went through it, discussed what we wanted to do, and, um... Uh, you know, we're simple people, you know, uh, we just went to this place in Dallas uh, called Hunkies to grab a burger. And then uh, after that, we went back to the store where my mom was. And uh, we all just hung out and watched the movie in the back. And then uh, when store closed at six, we went home and then uh, my wife, my son and I just hung out for a bit and that's about it. So nothing too exciting happened, but hey, you know, uh, this is just another day. I'm, I'm, I'm good to my dad all year round, so I don't need a specific day to show him that I love him. Oh yeah, and as always, I went and picked up so I, I'm out of the Bubblies now, so I'm on to the Kirkland brand uh, sparkling water again. Got myself a delicious lime flavor today. Oh yeah, no problem, man. I'm learning how to use Excel a lot better, watching you use it a lot. Oh yeah, of course. Great J-Man, how's it going? Uh, yeah, well no, I, I typically I'm done around like five or six. Uh, the, I normally, you know, normally I do these streams a little later to lead into uh, DJs, but um, I got groceries and things to get, and so I just decided to do it earlier than, uh, I decided to do it early and just get it out of the way. Um, but yeah, I uh, yeah no 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 particular no particular reason other than that. Just uh, I want uh, the tour is only up for two days, and I'm gonna be busy tomorrow. So I figured I was like, well, today's as good a day as any to do it, right? Oh yeah, you're learning how to use Excel a lot better. Watching me use it. Oh yeah. Um, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sit here and tell you uh, you know I. I've always been upfront when uh, you know, uh, and you know, I don't do it as like humble brags or just you know self-deprecating or whatever. I'm not, I'm not the world's best Excel person, uh, but I, like I said, I do use it a lot. I use it every day at work. So um, yeah, I mean, if you ever have any Excel-related questions, I mean, seriously, like let me know. I'll be more than happy to help you out. Um, that's part of the reason why as well. Uh, uh, you've seen like the shard calculators and some of the other things that I've made and uh, sent out to the community and everything. Uh, it's just, you know, I, I know how to use it, so I would like to share that knowledge and share the share those with everybody else. Yeah, I um, yeah, I saw beast mode. Uh, yeah, I saw beast mode got invited to the like I said, uh, thank you for thank you for inviting him in. And uh, I hope that a lot of people benefit from, uh, in the channel from his videos because he certainly knows what he's doing.
Yeah, the uh, I still haven't touched Alpha, by the way. I um, now that the now that the tours come up, I might uh, I mean I might work on them just a little bit. Uh, you know, just enough to be able to, to to do stuff with them. But you know, I you know. I, I'm always like apprehensive about using coins and stuff at the end of the month when you have another TU coming up, but uh, I'm sure he's somebody that is going to be getting uh, getting a lot of use from me at some point in the future. Striker between Alpha and HOF Sarge. So, um, so M. Jackson, uh, there is a gentleman, uh, or actually, I don't want to assume anything. I don't know if he's a dude or a dudette, but uh, in my Discord, there is a um, what? Well, uh, great J Man, uh, Great J Man Gaming is actually the one who told me about it. Um, there is a, there's a guy who goes by Beast Mode Gaming. And, uh, basically, he has a... Is there a way to fix the disconnect issue in the mobile game? Uh, I, I was just, I'll finish my thought first. But, basically, uh, Beast Mode uh, has made some excellent videos uh, basically pushing people... Uh, kind of pushing cer certain characters to the limit. And, um, yeah, it's just... It's crazy... How some of his setups and trainers are uh, are, are created. So I definitely would recommend giving him a follow. Um, a J Man, uh, since I'm playing right now, uh, do you mind linking his uh, YouTube here so that uh, we can get a couple people taking a look at his stuff? And then to answer your question about the the disconnect issue, I have no. Uh, I've had to deal with that too. I don't know what the I don't know what it is. Uh, it's one of the. It's like basically a new like, a, you know, asset bundle error or whatever whatever it is. So um, I, it might be one of those things where uh, a reinstall takes care of it. You know, like uh, delete and reinstall fixes it. I don't know. But. Um, yeah, I, I, I've had that pop up on my game, too. Turn the sound off on my work phone. I think this is going to be like some of the other ones where it's just like the one character over and over and over. Thank you very much for the resubscribe. <laughs> How are you doing, sir? I'm uh, doing good. Uh, so, I uh, thankfully uh, a couple of meetings that I want that I didn't want to go to got canceled. So I was super stoked about that, and. Uh, I have a couple plans for this evening, so I wanted to go ahead and uh, stream the limited time tour now and get it out of the way. How's your day going? Also, uh, I know I had to leave... Uh, at, at a certain point, um, I, I I did end up maxing the Damien Priest uh, event, but I didn't end up pulling them, unfortunately. But eh. <laughs> oh no, it's all good. Look, it, it happens. You know, look, you know, you can't pull every single character every single time.
you got to the second to last and didn't get either. Yeah, well, I wasn't actually, I wasn't pushing to max it, uh, but uh, basically, uh, you know, since I got Gargano and Drew from scratch, uh, you know, I was able to build them up. I, I built them up to like level 70 or level 80 or something after the coin, uh, after the coin Evo event started. Uh, Cause I was right on the cusp of finishing the the solo uh, the solo uh, milestones anyway, so I was just like, ah, screw it, I'll go ahead and do it. So I, I put in I put in the coin and uh, built up. Like I said, I built up Drew and um, Gargano to a certain point. Plus, you know, having the shards saved me the TP. And then um, you know, I had uh, I had some fuses and stuff. That, you know and shards for other uh for for other people and i was just like yeah you know it's like what's the point of sitting on these all the time so i said screw it and just went ahead and uh <laughs> I, I i just went ahead and uh maxed it and uh i did uh, like i said I, I i got off uh saturday night and then i got drew and gargano on sunday so all in all a very fruitful weekend for me Plus, I got to see your stream. I still don't have Becky's gear, but if, but thankfully this made it a lot easier working her on normal mode. Do you think all this MLC solo was easier than usual? Yeah, oh yeah, absolutely. And here's the thing, I hope that they, uh, so, I don't know about y'all. Um, I actually like the original format that they used to do this with, uh, do this under um, that they did for like you know the, when they did it originally for Rated R Superstar and for uh, Fandango. I actually liked it the way it used to be. Uh, that's uh, that's of course just a personal preference. Um, and then you know and then of course they changed it and uh, you know I never went for an MLC character after that. But, uh, I mean, I really like it the way that it is. Uh, I hope they keep it. Um, a couple people have been saying that, uh, you know, a couple people have been saying, like, oh, well, the only reason why they made it easy is because they're going to end up making it harder because 5SG's down the line and this and that. Look, I, whatever it is, you know, Scopely does change the formula of how the game's played from time to time. Um... Some changes are for the better, some changes are for the worse. You know, I mean, obviously it's a personal preference. But um, if they keep this format as far as the uh, MLCs go, I think that that's really, really good. Um, and again, I was extremely happy with it. Um, but, you know, I guess we're, we'll, I mean, we'll, we'll see, we'll see going forward, you know, how they end up being. I mean, I'm definitely going to remain optimistic about it. If somebody else wants to wants to be negative and complain and whatnot, then you know that's on them. Bacchus, how's it going? I know a rare early, uh, well, early for me at least. I I know around the world. Uh, Everybody's time zones are a little different. I know Merrick's being on uh, the West Coast. It's uh, 3.30 for him right now. And then uh, my buddy's over in England. It's 11 o'clock. It's, uh, it's almost midnight. But yeah, but no, not much. Just uh, had a thankfully easy day at work. Uh, I got to skip out on some meetings that I didn't want to go to because they got canceled. And... Uh, 
I am going to go uh, get a couple groceries and this and that a little later on. So I decided to do this a little bit earlier uh, versus uh, I usually, so I usually do a lead in to, um, to either DJ or um, Garrison stream in the evening just so I don't like conflict with their, with their times. But yeah, I just, I got stuff to do later, so I figured I'd just do this a little bit earlier. Doing the victory tour for Braun. Yeah, I, you know, um, I, you know, like, I, I got, I got Drew, I got Gargano, um, and, you know, uh, you know, like, a lot of great characters, this, you know, I got Alpha and everything, but for whatever reason, I just got very unlucky with uh getting any of the ancillary characters this month so uh i didn't get damien priest i didn't get the apa jbl uh but i mean eh, you know look it, it happens i got i got trickster jbl so i am not complaining in any way shape or form Yeah, but you know the only, but the, but the thing too is, uh, you know, I, I'm always limited on you know. I, I always tell people it's like I'm always limited on either tokens, posters, or coins. It's either it's always it's always one of those three. And uh, ever since I started doing polls and stuff for for content, uh, yeah, it, it's been it's been hard chasing uh, who to build up when and why and where. But you know, it's been it, you know it's been you know it, it's first world problems right ak6 better than me i've got no new cards for this month i'm sorry dude well i'm certainly sending you good vibes ak and I, and I hope that uh, you get lucky in one of the milestone bags or something and you're able to get yourself a new character ASAP. I'm happy I got off and close to Max and Soul. Yeah, the uh, I don't. I guess I, I'm super stoked about it. So uh, I gotta kind of. I, I do have to thank Fish Camp for it. So uh, in talking with him about kind of how the the, you know how how his faction handles minimums and whatnot. Uh, I didn't like. I wasn't a complete jerk about it. Uh, as y'all can tell, I'm not, you know, I'm, I'm not, a, I'm not really, you know, mean or rude or, or anything like that. Uh, but I, I kind of was, uh, you know, after, after barely missing Luke last month, uh, you know, I kind of told my faction, I was like, Hey, look, you know, kind of want to try something new, you know, um, especially on the blitzes. Like I would like, you know, the, you know, I would like a minimum of half a percent with the stretch goal of 1% per P for everybody. And we rallied, and I mean, like, there's, uh, J-Man, uh, there's, what, uh, a dozen of us now that had, that got off, uh, if not more? No, have you ever saved all your lost pass, you saved passwords from Chrome? Um... Yeah, uh... No, I can't. Uh, yeah, Swaggy Davis. By the way, I don't want to make it seem like I didn't mess, uh, didn't see that. I am doing fantastic. I hope you are having a wonderful day as well. But yeah, uh, I've no, I've never lost all my passwords in Chrome. Uh, so, what I do, uh, just kind of as a backup. So. Uh, 
I use Firefox as well, uh, you know, because, you know, every once in a while you run into a site that doesn't run on Chrome for whatever, for God knows whatever reason. So uh, I, on a somewhat regular basis, will transfer over all my passwords to Firefox. And then uh, that way, if anything were to ever happen, I have a backup for my passwords because all I have to do is just import from Firefox and I'm good to go. Yeah, Bacchus, your, your faction's going to 1.25. Yeah, I, you know, the, I, I know other, I know other factions are, uh, I, I know other factions, you know, instead of 1%, you know, like, they don't look at, like, hey, we don't want to just max Blitz, we want to go, like, above and beyond to max the faction MLC event as well. Um, we're not at that point yet, uh, I mean, not that anybody's complaining, but, uh, cutting a bunch of stragglers really helped, um, and I don't know, like, sometimes, you know, it's like, I hate saying this because I don't want to sound like a hypocrite. Um, you know, in our faction, we don't have, you know, we, we don't have really stringent, uh, minimums or anything like that. But, uh, you know, like we always said like, Hey, we just want like general participation from people. And it seemed like the same ones were just, you know, I, like, you know, when it came time to help out with, with, you know, faction, you know, with like with showdowns, with feuds and everything, never, never helped out with those, but never had issue with, uh, you know, it's like, you know, it's like, while they, while they never had a problem, you know, uh, collecting rewards, they never, you know, went, you know, above and beyond or, you know, attempted to help, you know, earn those rewards. So we kind of, you know, in our, you know, in our thing of like saying like, hey, you know, it's like my goal is half a percent or one percent. Um, I had a bunch of people who were just flat out said, I'm not going to do it. You can't make me. So and I was just like, all right, fine. You know, if that's what you're going to be, you're more than welcome to leave. And some left on their own and the others got kicked out. Uh, <laughs> but. Um, but yeah, I mean, uh having uh, like i said having having that really helped out yeah the you know again i you know look this game isn't my life my my my, my wife and my son are but it, it does get incredibly frustrating when you put in a lot of work and people don't help out even like at the bare minimum so uh like i think half a percent i i, I don't i don't want to i don't want to be a liar here or make up numbers but like for a lot of it like half a percent or one percent was like doing six hard mode runs with like an nwo character or something like you know something like that uh especially on on this month everybody has an nwo character uh you know i put out the professor iron chic how to speed run uh you know how to speed run gauntlet blitz videos and we still had people who either refused to do a single run or, you know, uh, you know, like, you know, they do like one run, no bonus. And, you know, whenever we would say like, hey guys, you know, we need everybody to chip in, would refuse to, and we're like, okay, fine. You know, have fun being in a faction that, you know, uh, you know, doesn't get any rewards, doesn't get any of these, uh, you know, of these nice things. Um, we had one guy in particular, like I said, he just, uh, the, the very, the, the very first day of the blitz just flat out said, uh, just flat out said, you know, like, uh, nobody's going to get off us. So I'm not even going to buy us. So I'm not going to do any blitzes and, you know, in, in this and that. And, you know, we're on pace to having like at least like 20 or 30% of our faction getting them. So he was wrong. He was very, very, very wrong. <laughs> Oh no, AK. No, no, no. I like, uh, like I said, we got. I, I, we're very happy. Like I said, we're we we're about to get to 24, 25, and then. Uh, J man, thank you very much for the bits. Yeah, like I said, thankfully, um, like I said, me, me mentioning this stuff, it's uh, like I said, it's it's a it's it was a very small uh, it was a very small number of our faction that did that. This wasn't an overall arching thing, and you know it wasn't a lot of people. But I mean, uh, you know, shifting some people in and out has really done wonders for our numbers. 
Zandal, how's it going? And Sean, how's it going? Good to see you too. I was regaling everybody with how we cut a bunch of slackers in our faction and a bunch of us have now gotten Afa and how we had uh, several naysayers that said we wouldn't do it and didn't want to try and uh, they were proved wrong. Let me, uh, just as beast mode real quick. All right. Yeah, so Sean, yeah, so, so great J Man, like I said, his, uh, it game name is Can You Smell It? Uh, he's in my faction as well as uh, Sean. So yeah, we've uh, we we weeded out some slackers and it's been uh, it's been fun. So yeah, let me. Um, I just uh, I just double checked with um, yeah. Uh, I I just asked Beast Mode if he'd be willing to let me play his video because uh, I just I want to be polite and make sure that you know he's cool with it. And if he is, I'll uh, I'll show everybody his off a of build to the stream if not then y'all can uh seek it out on your own time oops oh, damn it yeah, I didn't. event is lacking on people yeah. oh uh this trish one um yeah actually surprisingly i have everybody for it i just want to see i wanted to see how far i can get free aftershock yeah yeah i i have them so i'm looking forward to it Yeah, unfortunately, I don't have Tech Roman. Swaggy Davis, thank you very much for the host. Well, um, I'm going for Batista in the, uh, you know, out of the uh, showdown uh, icons WrestleMania people that you can get. But don't forget, there's attrition there, so... Um, I don't know if your goal is to get, uh, you know, Macho or Batista or something out of there, but uh, that, that's there. And also for, for everybody who says they don't have a female striker, uh, don't forget Becky's in there and she's not bad at all. Technically 99 cents. Assuming you have a trip. Yeah, I, uh. Yeah. I might be willing to, might be willing to put a few coins into her. But, um, let's see, move charge. Yeah, I don't plan on using Shelton anytime soon. Oh yeah. I joked, oh yeah, by the way, Barracks, I joked around with, uh, oh, with, uh, great G-Man X, uh, you know, I told him, uh, I, I, of course, like, you know, since he's in my faction, I shared, I was like, hey, look, I got Drew, yay! And uh, he asked me if I if I told you, and I said that you openly wept on camera. 
<laughs> J-Man, thank you very much for the host. Uh, please don't tell me this stream. Great. Out of memory, if you are the developer of this content, try allocating more memory to your WebGL build in the WebGL player settings. Great. Uh, let me just make a note of this so I can uh, write a ticket out to Scopely. So... Crash at 42 minutes. Oh, uh, well, uh, I think uh, Merrick said you have to buy one single coin, so you have to spend 99 cents in order to get that first-time bonus of 110,000 uh, points, and then that'll get you the Aftershock plate. to set a 30 minute timer on my watch and I didn't and that came back and bit me in the ass here <laughs> alrighty but still Scopely is good about uh, getting the uh, you know getting my HP back and plus especially when I have uh, when I link directly to the YouTube uh, to the YouTube feeds for these that, that really helps out there we go and I'll go ahead and just give myself a couple props just in case where's my yellow oh I already have it okay so just the Shango curse for blue in case it's needed and bam let's get going Really? Okay, I'm gonna... Well, like I said, I haven't gone through that yet, but I will be soon enough. Oh, best mode. So is this beast mode, by the way? All right. Oh, well, hey. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, I just... Uh, here's the thing. I, I know your stuff's already on YouTube anyway, but, uh, you know, I try to be polite and ask people for their permission before I play their content. Um, just, you know, out of respect, it's, you know, it's your content, not my content. I'm just gonna do this for the damage. There you go, and then because this is gonna fill it back up right again. Bam, there we go. go
Any points on the portal? Um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll check real quick. I don't, um, uh, I've been having the exact same problem all of you have where, uh, nothing's showing up in the portal. If it is, it's showing up, like, very, very late in the evening. Yeah, let's check it out. Yeah, I, what is it, um, around, like, what is it, around 2 o'clock, uh, so Central Standard Time, so about four hours ago, um, I took a break from work to go downstairs and eat lunch, and, uh, you know, like, I was trying to, I was trying to play a, a round or two, and it just, like, it just froze on me, so I didn't even bother, yeah, so, hold on, um, yeah, so full mode, yeah, so here, this is, these are my reward, whoops, Whoa, okay, didn't mean to, yeah, so right there, rewards, no available items were found, so I might check again later on tonight, um, here, um, yeah, I've heard, I've heard about that, uh, here, fine, I'll, uh, yeah, it's fine. It'll pop up. I'm. I if they show up, they show up. If they don't, they don't. Alright, since we have so many on here right now, uh, so just to ask, uh, so in the attitude, okay, so attitude era, of course, uh, were you, uh, were you a fan of Trish or were you a fan of Lita? Or one of the, or, uh, or one of the other female wrestlers? So of course there was, um, yeah. So I, I would say like, I, uh, so I personally, I, I, you know, my waifu was, uh, was Lita, not Trish. Oh yeah, you can like them both. So yeah, I, uh, so Bacchus, yeah, definitely. I was, I was a big fan of Sunny. I think if I had to say so, I would say, uh, I would say Sunny was probably like my first crush. Uh, when it came to wrestling. Supercard, how's it going? Yeah, oh yeah, by the way, I'm not talking about just, like, just looks or anything like that. Uh, I'm talking, like, as a wrestler. I, uh, I was definitely, like, I, I liked, I liked Lita way better than I liked, uh, uh than I liked, uh, Trish. I thought, I thought Lita was a much better wrestler than Trish was, was, is, used to be, whatever, whatever term you want to, you want to put in there. Oh, so Beth Phoenix. Yeah, I was, I was definitely, I was definitely a big fan of the Glamazon. I don't know, like, so, I know you're probably, uh, <laughs> okay, by the way, I, you know, like I said, liking wrestlers and things, of course, is 100% subjective, you know, who you, who you like as a wrestler is different from who I like as a wrestler, uh, so I, I want to make sure that, you know, it's like, I preface that by saying, like, I don't want you to think, like, I'm making fun of you or saying, like, oh, how do you like Sable or blah, blah, blah not not in any way shape or form but yeah jim Cornette, like you know whenever he was talking about sable versus uh you know versus her uh you know it's like 
uh, you know, it's like he was doing an impression of her, uh, of, of Sable, and he's like, here's for all the men that want to, that, uh, for, all the, uh, for all the men that want to be me, and all, or all the men that came to see me, and all the girls that want to be me. And, like, when he made her, when, when he made, like, that, that really nasally, like, when, when, you know, when he made fun of her with the super nasally voice, I was just like, oh my god, yeah, that is right. But... For the record, I don't want to. I I I do not want to make fun of Sable in any way, shape, or form. I do not want Brock Lesnar breaking down my door <laughs> and coming after me. Which, uh, by the way, I know I know uh, you know just like uh, so. I don't know if you all know about this his, uh, this wrestling lore or not, but uh, you know Sable is married to Brock Lesnar, and. Um, Brock actually, I think, I so I, I don't quote me on this because obviously I don't have like a police record or whatever in front of me, but uh, Sable actually got a restraining order against Brock, uh, and Brock like broke into her house like by literally like I think like he broke a door down or something like that, <laughs> and. Uh, yeah, for whatever reason, she just uh, really ended up falling in love with Brock, and now they're together and have, like, what, three, two, three, four kids or whatever it is? So, Zandal, you did one pull and you pulled a 4SG tr Striker Trish. Congratulations! So, uh... I have Hall of Fame Trish and I have Striker Trish. I don't have Acro or the uh, Icons WrestleMania Trish. Uh, my, my Hall of Fame Trish is built up more, so that's why I have that. Yeah, but yeah, but uh, yeah, but for real, yeah, he really did. Like I said, he re literally uh, broke into broke into her house. <laughs> yeah. So by the way, yeah. Um, one of my faction mates asked me earlier so like the optimal build for her is uh kind of the same she, she's literally a, a copy of lesnar um so uh uh do do green green black with steel and titus and you should be you should be everybody good uh you should be good There you go. I just put just putting a little bit into her. There we go. See Nikki Bell and H.E. Lee are your all-time favorites. Yeah, I so my all-time favorite women's wrestler. Um, well, probably. Uh, I mean, Beth is definitely up there. Uh, trying to think if there's anybody else. Like, I just, I was, I really, really like Beth Phoenix. Um, I should have just gone for the sub there. Uh, uh, yeah, it probably, like I said, it probably, yeah. I want to see Bianca versus Beth. What a powerhouse match. Yeah, that would definitely be a good match. I really... So, here's the thing. I really like Bianca Belair. There's only one thing I don't like about her. And uh, she's toned down on it. Although I did see a bunch of it at Hell in a Cell for obvious reasons. Um, so, seeing her twirl her hair... 17,489 times a minute during matches completely turned me off of her. That, like, I just, you know, like, seeing her just, like, punch, swing her hair, punch, swing her hair, punch, swing her hair, cough, swing her hair, look to the left, swing her hair, look to the right, swing her hair, 
drove me up the fucking wall with her. I, I absolutely hated her. I was just, I could not stand her at all. But since she's toned that down, like, I like her a lot more than I used, than, you know, than I was at uh, other points. Yeah, like I said, she's since she's cut that down, like much, like I said, much more of a fan of hers. All right, it looks like I might lose this match, which is okay. All right. Yeah, shag, I got got on this one. Oh yeah, that's, you know, and here's the thing, like, I, I know I talk about Bianca Belair like that, you know, it's like in, like, rest, you know, it's like, I know sometimes people are like, oh, it's like, you get, you know, you get, uh, you know, you get so riled up about small things. So, I, like, one of the things I can tell y'all is, uh, you, if I get pissed off, uh, it, it really, like, it, it's, you know, like, my friends laugh about it, they, you know, it's like, because, like, you know, it's like, once something sets me off, they're like, oh, dear God, here he starts again. Um, like, for example, uh, this, like, uh, I, okay, I get that it's fast food, for the record, okay? Um, uh, but Sonic, I absolutely, positively dislike the two guys that they used to have in the commercials thank god they're gone now but you know you know like the the two the the two dudes in the commercials and there was always like the one idiot you know there there are two of them there's the one that was in the driver's seat uh with the black hair and then there was like the the super balding blonde haired guy in the passenger seat i could not stand either of them i absolutely hated them and i didn't eat at sonic for like what the better part of a decade because of those commercials uh i oh i could not stand them at all i hated him hated him hated him and now that they're gone uh like i actually went and got a cherry limeade the other day. <laughs> uh Yeah, you don't like Becky, and that's not popular. Yeah, so um, I'm not just picking ba piggybacking off of what you what you're saying. Um, the only thing that uh, I like Becky the wrestler. Um, it's just uh, I got sick of the man promos like a week after she's uh, after they started um i don't know i like i don't know like i, like, I think she's fine um you know out of the horsewomen like uh i i definitely like sasha and bailey more but you know again like i said i'm talking about i'm talking you know uh subjective um, here, I'll, I'll, ch I'll check in a moment. Uh, the... She's not fully built up, I can tell you that much right now. Um... Yeah, I'm, I'm, hey, look, I'm willing to try it. I, I think she's a, I think she's a three star goal. Just as a heads up, she's not a four star, because I, I do know that 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 the optimal build for her is that blue blue something or other. But uh, I'm unfortunately I'm not at that point yet.
yellow finisher BB. Yeah, let, let, let me, yeah, I, I was gonna say, yeah, the blue blue with the finisher, I know that that's the optimal build, it's just, uh, like I said, she's not a, I, I, like, I don't know what level she's at, but she's definitely not four star, I, I know that for a fact. SG when I level up the move, start making two extra gems, and now it doesn't work anymore. Yeah. Alright, so brother asked me to help some, uh, help out my parents with something. Yeah, so like I said, she's, she's at 3 SG, and, um, yeah, you don't get the second, you don't get the stratosphere until 4 star. Vic, how's it going? Oh, uh, Hall of Fame Trish. Yeah, um, maybe later on I'll uh, I'll get the, the 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 rest of the shards I need to move her up. But uh, you know what? We can take we can take a short break from this. Uh, let me just go. Uh, no, it's kind of hoping that I got more uh, Hall of Fame Trish shards in there, but apparently not. Let's head over to the prizes here. Got right, what, 6 to 16. Alright, so typical stuff here. Right. All right. So got some medals. All right. More. There's that, and then we got the tier four epic medals. That jazz. Here's the aftershock plate that I'm hoping I get. Alright. Alright, heading back into the tour. So let me just double check something real quick. So this is these are just tokens and the only way to get more points is via beating it with Trish. There you go. 
I'm trying to think of what more I could do here that I'm not already doing. I mean, because even if I were to build this up, I mean, it's really not going to add that much of a significant amount of damage. The most I could do is just finish leveling her up, but then um, also wasting a bunch of TP. Oh, hey, congratulations! Congrats on getting that gear. I think this is probably going to be like the last time that, that, that you're probably going to be able to get it. Let me just do a browser refresh real quick. Uh, for the sake of uh, not drawing this out, I might just finish off the, the tour without without Trish and then uh, kind of just do it offline and see where I get from there. JFT, yeah, that's 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 a hell of a. Sometimes you know that's a hell of an issue to have. Is you know I have you know I have five different tier one characters. Which one do I want? Oh yeah, trust me, Sean. I actually got Earthquakes gear three times, and I still don't have them. So trust me, I know your pain. Right. There we go. Of course, the portal's being laggy. There we go. Zombie Alistair and Memrock, ugh. I say this with all the love in the world, but I don't like you very much. <laughs> Those are certainly two of my unicorns right there. Yeah, Vic. Sometimes that's crazy how it works out. So like, uh, like my tech division, my so my tech division was straight up trash. I'm just telling you that right now. My absolute worst category in the game, male female didn't matter. And then in the span of three weeks, I got Sako, I got uh, Rhea Ripley, and I got um, and I got Ciampa. And then on top of that. Uh, I got Hall of Fame Eddie a couple weeks later, so it was just like I went from it being my worst category to my best category in no in no time. Or maybe not my best. I'd have to look through and see which which category I'd say is my absolute best. I think I think Showboats now are, are my worst. I know saying that probably makes Merrick go Merrick's go. Ooh! Yeah, right now, so there are only three zombies that I don't have. Triple H, don't have Taker, and I don't have Aleister Black. Other than that, I have every single zombie, male or female. And man, when the, when, when the demigod mode was around, oh boy, I tried, I tried. Yeah, so I know I was talking earlier about about rallying the troops and you know uh, getting rid of slackers. Uh, 
what kind of opened up our eyes a little bit more to it was uh, the the Daniel Bryan certainly is where several people got cut. Uh, not because they didn't spend, but they wouldn't do the nodes, you know, or do the check-in, the daily check-in for free, where you don't have to pay a single fucking penny. Uh, you know, but so, uh, but yeah, we, we, we were able to get Dan Zombie Daniel Bryan. And then, of course, right after that, I pulled Hall of Fame Scott Hall, so... You know, there's that, and then with Seek a month and everything, and then Sako using up green TP. I, I really had to, <laughs> really having to squeeze for that. There we go. Yeah, well, you know, I mean, uh,. That's one of the things is just, you know, it's like, it's trying not to go overboard on TP events or, you know, uh, you know, this and that, you know how it is. Oh, Sean, no, no, dude. Hey, trust me. That wasn't a, uh, that wasn't a, uh, that wasn't a veiled shot or anything at you or anybody else. Because trust me, one thing about me, if I have something to say, I'll say it. <laughs> and if people are happy with it, great. If they're not, then so be it. There we go. See, that's one of the things I hate. Of course, shuffle the fucking board to where... You know, they're able to break all three of my sub-gems in one fucking go there. Oh yeah, M. Jackson, yeah, you get, you get a free five-star character of your choice with it. Oh yeah, I mean, like I did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the one. Th that's that's one of the things I don't get sometimes. Is look, even you know, even me with my with you know with with, with doing paid polls and things. I don't have every single character in this game, um, but you know, like it's just you know going on the portal and spending you know 30 seconds checking it in, you know checking it uh, I just I don't understand why people couldn't do that the absolute simplest easiest thing that you could do <laughs> I'm Jax, yeah I'm screwing with you just uh... <laughs> hope you're not mad I was just I was just I was just, uh, I was just... Uh, just saying that as a joke. It would be cool though, right? <laughs> yeah, the quote Rainier Wolf Castle, the idols, they do nothing. Cut me out of Merrick's gummy bears. Oh, oh man. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, okay? You have by all means, I want you I want you to cut out Merrick's gummy bear money of all like you, you you have my permission. I I I should you know you should really teach me a lesson and not subscribe to Merrick's. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Yeah, what better way? What better way to teach me a lesson than by not providing him any gummy bears? <laughs> oh, 
Although, what is it? Uh, I, uh, I haven't. I, I was kind of thinking about it. Um, yeah, if you go, you pulled Acro Trish at five SP. Congratulations. That's what they're saying, by the way. Uh, yeah, about Molly Holly this weekend. So, uh, apparently, you know, with it being like the mighty, the with it being, uh, yeah, being mighty, you know, the mighty faction or whatever it is. Yeah, they're saying it's Molly Holly, and they're also saying that whatever um, the the data miners or whatever they they say that the that the code in the game or whatever is. Uh, Nora backwards, you know, and Nora is a real name. So, I, I mean, I, at least that's what they're saying. And whether there's any validity to that, I don't, I don't know. I'll just find out just like everybody else will. Yeah. Yeah. The Acro Trish is probably the best one in the game. But yeah, congratulations. That's a hell of a pull. Have I decided my few lineup? Ah, uh, nah, not yet. I, uh, I always kind of wait till the last day on that. Um... I, I mean, I have a I have a basic idea of who I'm gonna do. So uh, it's sometimes it's just it's a, just a formality of actually getting around and doing it. But you know, I I, I just wait because maybe I'll get lucky between then and now. Tamina's real name is Serona as well. Yeah, well, Tamina book is, ooh, Tamina. the blog post for today we don't need to play the daily tours anymore um i don't i haven't seen the blog post for for, for today yeah io shirai would be fantastic to have i mean uh here's the thing i know um I know when it comes to certain characters getting released, sometimes, like, you and G and everybody else get to know ahead of time, and then other times it's, you know, you learn, uh, you learn about it just as soon as we do, so, um, yeah, I mean, like, I, like I said, I'm not, uh, I don't think that, um, I don't, Tamino would, would certainly fit the, yeah, they don't tell you, oh, okay. Um, I don't, I mean, here's the thing, I like Molly Holly, yeah, uh, I like Molly Holly way better than I like Tami uh, Tamina, but Tamina actually fits the, uh, theme of, you know, the Samoan legacy and whatnot, so, I mean, either way, you know, it'll be, it'll be fine, you know, uh, we'll, 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 like I said, we'll see, we'll see what it, We'll, we'll, we'll send it. We'll, we'll see what happens. Alright, J-Man, no problem. Yeah, I'm gonna be done. This is literally the last match and then I'm done. But as always, thank you for the support. Thank you for showing up. And I hope you enjoy dinner. Yeah. M&L will be revealed blog too. Yeah. Vlog tomorrow, yeah. Basically. Yeah, I'm gonna say, uh, like I said, I know sometimes people like to know about that stuff at a time. I, like I said, it, it doesn't bother me. I'll find out, like I said, I'll find out with, with everybody else. The one thing I am looking forward to, oh yeah, I forgot to mention this. I'm super, something I'm super excited about. Um, 
So uh, there's a CC's, uh, there's a C, oh yeah, exactly, yeah, it doesn't change anything, whether I know today or tomorrow, it doesn't, absolutely no change in my life whatsoever. But something cool that I could say, so the, the CC's Pizza next to me, uh, or one of them that's close to me, is doing a grand reopening on Friday, and uh, the first hundred people in line get free pizza for a year, and their definition of free pizza is one free buffet or one free large topping, oh, like one topping pizza a month. But uh, I got nothing better to do, and I'm going to be doing a half day uh, of work on Friday. And uh, yeah, I am going to go. I'm going to go stand in line. I'm probably going to head out there probably around 10 o'clock, and I'll wait in line, and I will get a free year of pizza. So I'm really looking forward to that. Pat, how's it going? Yeah, so, um, so ladies and gentlemen, yeah, with that, I am done with the Trish Tour. Um, now, I am going to go back and try to beat it with um, with my Hall of Fame Trish offline. Um, maybe I might end up having to do a few revives or whatever, but uh, I don't think there's going to be too much of a difference between then and now. But, uh, yeah, uh, as always, oh, Zandel, no, I didn't get the free Duncans. I ended up... Uh, I ended up getting too too bad. I, I had to do this in that around the house. I didn't get my free donut, unfortunately. But yeah, um, as always, uh, catch me on Twitch at IronSheek84. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe to this video. And uh, catch me on Twitch at IronSheek84 for more WWE Champions action. <laughs> and with that, I am going to go get some groceries. Best of luck in the Trish Tour, and I will catch you all later. Goodbye.